Hello there, welcome to this video and thank you for viewing my channel. This is going to be a general med monthly love tarot reading for the zodiac sign of Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the remainder of December 2019. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns regarding time frames, energies, things of that nature, all of that stuff should be addressed within the description box down below. If you'd like to donate to my channel or contact me regarding a personal reading, they're starting out at $20 for video readings right now. So um, if you're interested in that, my contact information is down below. So we're going to go ahead and get into it. Um, I'm doing a new spread here. You're the last sign that I'm doing here. Um, so I've done, I think I did this spread for Sagittarius, Virgo, and Scorpio. Those are the ones I've done today. So yeah, every sign before that, they got the old, they got the old spreads. So these have been a little bit longer because of these spreads, because I was doing you, your feelings, your person's feelings, um, you know, I think what's going on currently and the potential for the connection. And with this spread, I'm doing your feelings, their feelings, past, present, future, and advice. And I like the way that it's going so far, but, um, you know, I don't really look like I don't know <laughs> I just it, it, make, it makes them longer okay it, it makes the videos longer uh so I'm sure I'm sure people love that though but okay so let's go over your feelings here Libra I almost called you Scorpio okay you could be dealing with a Scorpio but could have it in your chart don't have to okay so your feelings your feelings three of cups Cancerian energy and ten of wands sagittarian energy so let's put these cards over here i need to straighten out this chair okay so let's take a look at your person's feelings let's take a look at your person's feelings here libra let's take a look at your person's feelings for the major december 2019 let's take a look at their feelings Ace of Swords reversed and the Five of Swords. So Aquarian energy and with the Ace of Swords reversed, um, Air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So um, let's take a look at what, what happened in the past. What went down in the past here? What went down in the past between Libra and this person? What went down in the past between Libra and this person? Bang, man, Piscean energy. Okay. So, um, let's see here. <clears throat> One down between you and this person. One more card in the past for Libra and this person. Uh, the Lover's card, Gemini energy. I feel communication issues is what I just got here. Uh, that's not what that card means, but that's what I'm getting. Um, so, yeah. One of the things Mercury governs is communication. Gemini is ruled by Mercury. So, I mean, um, that makes sense, I think. But, yeah, I feel like there were, there were challenges communicating is what I feel like saying. Um, what's going on currently? Jesus. What's going on currently? What's going on currently between Libra and this person? What's going on currently between Libra, Libra and this person? Eight of Cups and the King of Swords, Aquarian Energy, and Piscean Energy. So let's take a look at the future. What does the future hold for Libra and this person? What does the future hold for Libra and this person? What does the future hold for Libra and this person? Uh, Page of Swords, Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So... And the Four of Pentacles, uh, Capricorn energy. So let's take a look at the advice. What's the advice here? What's the advice for Libra in this situation? What's the advice for Libra in this situation? What's the advice for Libra in this situation? <clears throat> so Two of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups, uh, Aries energy and Piscean energy showing up here. So, <laughs> oh, Libra. Now, you guys can take these how they resonate, okay? Because I feel like, you know, this this could be vice versa. I'm feeling that it's vice versa for some of you, but, you know, whatever. Um, it comes out how it comes out, and I can't change the way it comes out. So, um, three of cups and the ten of wands. I feel like you want to reunite with someone. Cancerian energy and Sagittarian energy showing up here. So, I feel like you want to reunite with someone here, Libra. But I feel like it's not happening, okay? And I feel like, you know, it's leaving you in this burdening kind of... Did that come out in reverse? That may have come out in reverse. So, that... I, I'm not sure, though. I'm sorry, I can't remember, but if it come out in reverse, you know, regardless, okay, 
regardless, it's showing up with this Ten of Wands. Something's burdening you here, and I feel like it's, you know, the desire to reunite here is what I feel like saying here. Um, and I feel like it's something you wish for because the Nine of Cups is showing up here as well. Their energy, they've cut off communication, okay? They've cut off communication, and they're feeling good about it with this Five of Swords being present here. They're looking back on it, I think. Yeah, they're looking back on it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, because, you know, that's how they kind of won. It's like when people try to win the breakup. Now, I don't know if you guys were actually in a relationship. It was some kind of connection, though, and it's them trying to win the breakup here, um, regardless of whether or not it was, it was called, it was called a relationship, okay? They're like, you know what, I'm just going to cut off the communication here, because I feel like there were games being played with this Five of Swords, and I do feel like there was communication, there were communication issues in the past, is what I feel like saying here, and that's what led to this. That's what led to this, because it led to a bitter kind of energy who, where somebody felt like they had to win, you know? know is what I feel like saying somebody felt like they always had to have the upper hand and uh I don't know if that was you or them you you take it how it resonates but I feel like there was a petty kind of energy I'm getting a really petty energy off this hangman you know he's hanging upside down right but his face he's like I'm fine I'm chill look at his arms over his head I mean he's just like I'm straight you know what I'm saying okay well that's not over his head so I just looked really dumb but you know and I really don't think it's over his head actually I think he's just kind of tied to the pole there I don't think that they're yeah they're definitely not over his head I don't know why I said that anyways yeah he's a very stuck he's real he's just chill okay he's real chill but he's upside down here he's like suspended he's like he's feeling kind of stuck is what I feel like saying so Libra you could have been in a situation where there were challenges there were things that uh you know that um were causing you two to kind of grow apart okay they're this mountain here there were challenges to overcome but i feel like you know maybe you or i feel like it's you but it doesn't have to be but i feel like you know somebody was just chilling like i'm fine you know <laughs> it's straight or i feel like you know it's that energy of like i saw this meme the other day it just popped back up in my head where it's like me what's wrong it's like me to my girlfriend what's wrong and she's like nothing i'm fine and then it says girlfriend for the rest of the day and it's this video of this guy like stomping around slamming shit it's that kind of energy you know what i'm saying so it's like maybe this person did something and you were kind of afraid to you know tell them you know that this bothered you maybe you felt like it was petty okay maybe you felt like they wouldn't really understand it or they wouldn't really validate those feelings is what I feel like saying here so maybe you just didn't say anything about it but you were kind of petty and it did kind of show is what I feel like saying here um so that could have been what what this was in the past but overall and that's just for some of you overall I just feel Libra that there were communication issues is what I feel like saying here so present Libra somebody's walking away okay somebody's walked away here with this Piscean energy with this eight of cups and then with the king of swords energy here uh somebody's cut off communication is what I feel like saying here um for sure somebody's cut off communication I feel like somebody cut off emotion as well no they didn't I just got no they didn't nobody nobody cut off emotion here but communication was cut off okay um communication was cut off for sure and somebody walked away from the connection but coming up in the future somebody's not letting go of this somebody's still watching somebody's still curious is what i feel like saying here somebody's refusing to let go right air energy gemini libra aquarius capricorn with that four of pentacles but the advice here is showing up you know two of wands to me is a card of needing to take action libra so maybe you need to take action to close something out here. Maybe you need to take action to be honest, okay, about what you what it is that you want here. I don't know. But, you know, I feel like saying that, you know, you definitely need to figure out what um, what's benefiting your energy here and what's not. You know, this is Jupiter and Pisces. This is growth, luck, expansion. What's stopping you from expanding here, okay? Is it waiting on communication from this person? If you're waiting on communication from this person, then maybe you need to make the communication happen here because Two of Wands is the card of needing to take action to me as well. Figuring out what works for you and what works against you. So is sitting here in this energy of watching and waiting and holding on to something, is that helping you or would it help you more to just say, Hey, can I have some clarity here on what happened? Or, you know, if you have tried that and it's not really worked, I feel like saying maybe it would help you to just kind of say, Hey, you know, we're closing this out here. You know, I, you know, whatever, whatever the case may be, however it is that you, that you would close something out. Um, I feel like, you know, that could be what would get you out of, um, a stuck energy that I feel you are in. Okay. <sighs> okay. A burden energy, excuse me, a burden energy that I feel you are in. So let's clarify your energy here. Why not? Two of Cups reverse Cancerian energy, okay? Three of Swords showing up here on top as well. So, yeah, I definitely feel like you're wounded here, okay? I feel like you're wounded. I feel like you want to reunite with someone here. There could have been a third-party situation for some of you, but it doesn't have to be. But I definitely feel like you're feeling hurt here. You're feeling burdened by your feelings for a person that are not requited, is what I feel like saying here. Or communication that is not requited. Or you feel it's unrequited, I should say. Them, their feelings, let's see here. Their feelings. 
Five of Swords, the Ace of Swords in reverse, there's feelings. Yeah, we've got the Five of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords. I definitely feel a lonely energy off this Five of Pentacles. They're lonely, but they're trying really hard to cut off emotion here. Libra energy with this King of, with this Queen of Pentac or Queen of Swords buck and Taurian energy with that uh with that um Five of Pentacles. They're like, hold on. I just got something and it left me. It was really weird. Um self-will. Yeah, self-will. Uh they're not living off of self-will, okay? Libra, they're not living off of self-will. They don't care about what they want. They care about what they need, okay? So they feel like they don't need the conflict is what I'm getting here, Libra. They feel like they don't need the conflict. They don't care if they want, if they're too lonely, if they want to talk to you. They don't want the conflict, Libra. Okay, so that's what they're feeling here. So coming up in the past, the hangman and the lovers. Let's clarify that. Whew. Whew, God damn. No, I'm not, I'm not taking all those. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So Six of Cups did pop out, though. Six of Cups did pop out. So, in the past, yeah, I definitely feel like, I'm going to clarify that Six of Cups, why not? I'm going to clarify that, I'm going to clarify that Six of Cups. Can we clarify this Six of Cups, please? Can we clarify this Six of Cups? <clears throat> Can we clarify this Six of Cups? Can we clarify this Six of Cups? Um, Knight of Wands to the Six of Cups. Yeah, uh, Scorpionic energy with the uh, Six of Cups and uh, Sagittarian energy here, Libra with the um, with the Knight of Wands. So I feel like what kept this stuck here uh, as well was, you know, first of all, impulse communication with that Knight of Wands as well. Um, immature communication with the Six of Cups. It can be a card that talks about children. So I definitely feel like, you know, somebody had some childish communication uh, habits is what I feel like saying. Here's some impulse word vomit is what I feel like saying but also somebody was becoming a thing of the past and they were moving back in Come becoming a thing of the past and moving back in is what I feel like saying here it's just a very in and out kind of energy so that's what looks like was happening here in the past as well so the connection stayed stuck even though it felt like it was moving is what I feel like saying it only felt like it was moving because they were moving in and out there was a very in and out energy uh, showing up there so presently clarifying this king of swords and the eight of cups here clarifying this king of swords and the eight of cups clarifying the king of swords and the eight of cups five of swords <clears throat> And the Knight of Pentacles. So yeah, I feel like somebody wants clarity here, or somebody's bringing in clarity. But somebody is like, yeah, this is them. They want to, they want to bring in clarity. Okay, that's what they want. They're looking back on this. They're seeing how there wasn't a clean win here for anybody with this Five of Swords, Aquarian energy, and the Knight of Pentacles. They could be uh, deciding to bring you clarity, is what I feel like saying. Knight of Pentacles, Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aquarian energy with this Five of Swords. But you know, um, I, I'm not sure that they're moving though. Okay, I'm not sure that they're moving, but they're thinking about bringing in clarity. They want to bring in clarity because they're seeing how I feel like they're seeing how things were unfair here is what I'm saying is what I'm getting off of this five of the swords they're seeing how there wasn't a clean win for anybody who was involved is what I feel like saying here so um yeah the lover's card showing up here <sighs> yeah let's clarify this lover's card let's clarify this lover's card can we clarify this lover's card please eight of pentacles reverse so hold on let that card stay there to the lover's card so i clarified the lover's card eight of pentacles in reverse they don't feel like they put in enough work 13 13 as i was talking to the camera they don't feel like they put in enough work on this connection is what i feel like saying that's how they're feeling here they don't feel like they gave any clarity as well is what i feel like saying yeah they don't feel like they gave any clarity about this ending okay they feel like they just kind of you know put that last sword in there and you know no reason no rhyme no just kind of walked off okay is what i feel like saying here yeah, I think they feel like they cheated you somehow and they want to bring in communication. Seven of Swords, Ace of Swords, and the Nine of Cups in reverse. They feel like they cheated you out of what you wanted somehow is what I feel like saying here. Out of what you wished for is what I feel like saying with this Nine of Cups coming up in reverse and this Ace of Swords communication to me. But yeah, they feel like they cheated you out of that here by, you know, holding back whatever the case was here. By holding back, by not giving clarity is what I feel like saying. So the future. The future. Clarify this. Yeah, Four of Cups. Yeah, I just don't feel like, you know... I feel a very rejecting energy off of this. I think this person could fear being rejected. Uh, this Ten of Wands showing up here. Sagittarian energy. Cancerian energy with the Four of Cups. Sagittarian energy with the uh, Ten... Or, yeah, with this Ten of Wands showing up here as the future. Under Four of Cups, under Page of Swords. I don't think they're going to make a move here, okay? <clears throat> I don't think they're going to make a move here. Let me clarify that Four of cups can i clarify that four of cups i'm not taking all those okay i'm not taking all those 
the tower card scorpionic energy also fire so yeah i feel like they're afraid of like knowing that it's over okay so that's why they left it open that's why there was no clarity because they don't want to really know that it's over is what i feel like saying here libra so yeah i mean i feel like they want to make you an offer but at the same time they don't want to be rejected they don't want to be told that it's that it's ended okay so it's ending in a burden is what i feel like saying and i feel like they're not going to communicate okay libra i don't think that they're going to communicate but um i think that the advice here is for you to communicate okay uh you know, and what does it hurt to communicate? Even if they're the ones who cut it off, even if they're the ones who, you know, did X, Y, Z, even if you don't want this, even if you don't wish for a new beginning here, I feel like you wish for clarity and I feel like you wish for closure, okay? So I feel like saying that, you know, figure out is, is not communicating with this person, is it what you want? Is it what's, you know, contributing to your growth here is what I feel like saying? Or is it working against you? Is not, as you know, is not taking action. Is it working against you or is it working for you is what I feel like saying here, Libra. So that's for you to decide, okay? So that's what's coming up as the advice. So um, I'm not going to clarify that because it seemed pretty straightforward to me. And uh, so, yeah, I hope that you enjoyed this. I hope it resonated. If so, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe, tap the bell icon. Of course, if you'd like to see, if you'd like to receive notifications for when I upload new content. Um, if it didn't resonate, you know, this is a love reading. You could always watch out for the sign of the person that you were dealing with. Or, you know, you also have other signs in your chart. You could look out for those as well. If this didn't resonate, you might find a message in those readings as well. So, anyways. Thank you, Libra, so much for watching. Thank you for being patient. And um, I hope that you enjoy the rest of your month.